<laughs> Rihanna is back. That's worth saying again. Yes. Rihanna yes. is back. The pop sensation who is all set to perform at the Apple Music Super Bowl 57 halftime show in February teased her fans this week with a new video. The diva took to Instagram and shared an enthralling teaser ahead of her highly anticipated performance. Dressed in a black dress, layered uh, with an impossible to ignore feather yellow cape, Rihanna flaunted her Fenty style. Oh, uh, she also talked maybe about something about singing. Uh, <laughs> on her quirky hairstyle, that deserves attention too. Yes. The yes. beginning of the video sees the singer stepping out onto a walkway as voices in the background comment on how long it's been since she shared her own music. But now that the video is dropped, the fans can't keep calm about it. It's been 2,190 days. Dude, Rihanna, we waited it's for you. It's been over six years since the nine-time Grammy winner Rihanna dropped her last album. Riri, is where have you been? We've been impatiently waiting for the last time we got her. The fans Anti just predicted the end of Rihanna. Everybody has stuck. Rihanna, 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 <laughs> Question four. With a Bacardi shot, I'd swallow that. Rihanna Super Bowl tease makes even me like sports ball. Oh, yes. She is perfection. Mm -hmm. John, you slammed that down pretty quick. I did. You know, when I first heard she was going to be doing the Super Bowl halftime show, I peed myself a little bit. I, I am <laughs> that excited for this. But I tell you, not everybody is loving it. Uh, Stephen A. Smith, who's a well-known commentator on ESPN, was on uh, the Sherry Shepard show. Mm -hmm. And she asked if he was excited for Rihanna, and he looks at her and goes, Rihanna's a lot of things, but she's not Beyonce. And I was like, ooh! What? I know. So uh, there's a little controversy out there. She's getting a little, this show's getting a little juice. Well, you know what he really, by the way, um, what he really <laughs> meant is Beyonce didn't earn her billion dollars. That's what <laughs> really ooh. So, so, that, so let's go from the T. So first, I, I really just drank, as you said, damn. Can, when you said that, you I might. <laughs> that, that's, when I talk about the flawlessness of Rihanna from beginning to end, the the mogul and and her stepping out of that billionaire status of I've already done my own with my brain, my heart. I've been a mom. I am a mom. I've, I've done my thing. It's time for me to get back out there. Side note, I only thought that Sunday was all about the concert at eight o'clock. Uh, so uh, who knew there was a football game? <laughs> Tell me when so the thank commercial. So thank, so yeah, in commercial. So, so thank you, thank you, Rihanna, for that. Just mm -hmm. any self-respecting, especially let's make it gender specific of gay men. You know, I'm not excluding the rest of our acronym, but for gay men, does any self-respecting gay man care anything about football? We have a gay sports bar down the street. Yeah. Of course they yeah. do. Uh, yeah. yeah. Um, well, I, I care about football, but you said self-respecting, so I guess I'm out of oh, that. Yeah. <laughs> they like to tailgate, I've noticed. I don't know what that is, but I'm assuming it has something to do with gator tail. Yeah. <laughs> no, I just think tail. that it's, it's so interesting, right? Because like Lemonation said, when you do a pullback, so all of those voices that we're talking, think to yourself about where she started yes. and where she is at now. I mean, of all of the musical artists, she has done something that no one has ever done before. Success. She yeah, built so she built a company from the I remember still when that Fenty Beauty brand started, when the Fenty clothing yeah. brand started. Mm -hmm. She started those things. Mm -hmm. And that billion status, when it happened, it was like a reverberation. You could actually feel it changed the industry. Yeah. And I love the fact the ending with her doing the shh, because that's literally, guys, that's what she's been doing, everybody. That's where she's been. You know, it starts, with the first words that you hear, besides the clack of her heels, mm -hmm. which I loved, that was so sexy. <laughs> uh, the first words you hear is, we haven't heard from her in 2009. Isn't that so days. amazing? And so what, what, what caught, my, caught my attention, I have to cut you off, Al, is, all the names that they call her are the names that we call her really, really, really and you, you yeah. gotta say her name the appropriate way. And so they gave her, she, she moved in silence. And all the time, if you look at all the tabloids, all the news stories, they called her all those names. They said her name just Rihanna, Riri, like they just like that. And you heard all the people exactly come right. together. That's and true. and the other thing that I think is beautiful about this tease is we haven't heard from her in 2090 days. 
Uh, and, and of course, it's the embracement of her announcement. But for all of those people that think Rihanna is not relevant because we haven't heard from her in 2,090 days, she's the only one walking to the bank in laughter. Ooh. Because in the 2,090 days, she's created a business that makes more money than all yes. of her music combined from the ground floor. A uh, Barbadian uh, yeah, from right. Barbados, mm -hmm. a mm -hmm. black woman embracing the LGBTQ uh, community uh, and builds it from the ground up. Nobody gave Rihanna anything. Yeah. So in the last 2,090 days, here's to you, girl. Yeah. And we can't yes. wait. And, wait. Yeah. and let's, not, let's not even think about the, her body positivity that she brings in her pinky line. Right. She, has, she has big, she has small, she has, she has it all, everything. Yeah. Take over the world, mama. Take over the yeah. world. Sports ball is going to happen, but the most important thing happens <laughs> in the middle ball. of sports. Eight o'clock yeah. every day. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> LGBTQ plus news is vital for our community and for the broader world as a whole. We have enough enemies at Fox News. Tucker, Sean, and Lara are loud. We need passionate allies. Happening Out Television Network, Queer News Tonight, and It's Happening Out are literally out of the closet and into the headlines. Our community needs your support. Like this broadcast and subscribe now to ensure the growth of the entire LGBTQ plus community.